That was the killers with Under the Gun. So many things to talk about. I don't know how we're gonna keep it brief. Well, start it and we'll see. Their drummer, Ronnie, yeah. loves to do triplet kicks. Right, so. Mm-hmm. But he loves this fill horse. And I feel like all his songs, all the fills, this. Which is some variation of that in the end. And yeah. A lot of them, a lot of their songs have that fill horse. And I'm just like, Ronnie. But you can't hate it. No, nah, he does, does, does well with the song. He just does it to us. And it's, if anything, I was like, it's endearing. I'm like, every, and even up to their new album, eh? And I'm just like, yes, that's it, Ronnie, I know. And I love it to us. I, I love, I love our man also. I was in a white tea us. And he looks like that actor. Good actor. The drummer of the killers looks like some other actor. Ryan Gosling? No. Um, Horse. I don't this know. Name a movie or so I'll get. Oh, it was like Life of Something or something was a TV series. Oh, he looks like Jason Lee. Mm, yeah. 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 And I think they actually made a spoof about that. And like Jason Lee had come in and pretend yeah. to audition for the drama in, in some skit or something. Spoof about Jason Lee. Professional skateboarder. Really? Owns and operates serial skateboards. Awesome. Cool fact about Jason Schwartzman. Doesn't skateboard, but has a thing called Coconut Records. Okay. And there's a music video of him skateboarding. With, so he had two videos. I'm, I'm going deep skate. Yeah. I'm going to go deep in, into skateboarding <laughs> right now. So he had two videos, right? So, um, West, West Side, right? This is Jason. Yeah, this is uh, Coconut, Coconut Records. Records. Yeah. West Side. That's his huge hit. Such a yeah. great song. That's the same song, right? West Side. I West Coast, know. sorry. Yes, West, West Coast. Coast. Sorry, my bad. West Coast had the famous, legendary skateboarder Mark Gonzalez. Mm. It was footage of him in his art gallery in Germany, and he's yeah. just skating through the halls and skating through like boxes and stuff. And then, I can't remember that song. I don't know the other one. Had any fun? Mm. Anyway, something fun. Yeah. Um, he had Gonzalez back in it. In that video, Mark Gonzalez and um, that actress, uh, Chloe Sinavli, whoever her name is. Skin Novelli? I can't pronounce her name, also. It's like, it's real hard, dog. Why, why do you have fuck up name? It's like one of those names with the two dots. Okay, so like Nordic. Yeah, Nordic. Yeah, Descent. some some Scandinavian yeah. thing. Yeah, so he had two, two and it, yeah, some two skateboarders in it. Well, also speaking of skateboarding, which is a amazing. Uh, transition into this one. Skateboarding video man Spike Jones. Oh, here we go. Spike Jones, director of Weezer early oh. music. Yeah, directed Sweat the Song was the first video he directed with them. And then he did Buddy Holly. Yeah. And then he did Island in the Sun. And then he probably did something else. He might have done Say It Ain't So. I don't quote me on that, I'm wrong on a lot of things. Yeah. Um, but he did do El Scorcho. Uh, and speaking of El Scorcho, this is a Weezer B side. Wait, let me yeah. r- wrap it all up. Okay, in a nice basket first. In a nice basket. Jason Lee he's, and Mark Gonzalez yeah. was both part of this skateboard company that still exists called Blind Skateboards. And yeah. they released one of the most legendary skateboard videos called Blind Video Days. And it was directed by your boy, Spike Jones. So everything we just said. I know. All related to it. All and, related. And now but, here's a but song. Still related to still related to uh, killers. Um it did though. <laughs> oh, I think this would be real kicks if we just use this segment as a way to link everything. Other oh okay, we found our, our thing. Okay. That whole Jason Lee, uh, Jason Schwartzman. Coconut Records, Gonzo, Spike Jones, Weezer Link. Here is a B-side off of Weezer's Pinkerton, which was released for their deluxe edition. So this is super nerdy shit. Yeah. Um, you know how much I love Weezer. Yeah. I know. You know how I'm much sure. I love Pinkerton. Pinkerton. Yeah. So all of your angst and skateboarding is is packed into one song. It's really short. It's like a minute and a half. I'll just let you hear it. It's so um, stereotypical, Weezer, in the best way. So here you go. Weezer, you gave love to me softly. <laughs> <laughs> 